Welcome back. It's a new day, everyone. The 29th of Friday. That sounds lovely. It's been a while since I've come to a place like this. Sorry for dragging you along. Well, it's, it's a nice place. <laughs> I'm glad you like it. This suits you, huh? I wasn't sure if you were the type. Huh? I thought I recognized those glasses. Look who it is! And we even got the second detective prince here, too. For real? For real? Wait, what? Hmm. Keep it quiet, please. Oh, uh, sorry. But... That's not important. Why are you with a kitschy coon? I don't tell her anything. Don't tell her anything. I invited him out. We're fairly close after all. You are, huh? Oh, uh... Don't mind me, I'm just a reporter. Just. He helps me with my articles sometimes. Who would have guessed you were friends with the famous teen detective? I don't like you, he's pretty hardline anti-phantom thieves, right? Mind if I ask a couple questions about you two? Um, if you like. Oh. You're down? I was just kidding. I'm no model journalist, but I'm not dumb enough to pry into a high schooler's private life. I thought this report would be boring, but I got a nice surprise out of it. Well, see you next time I need info. You have some friends in the media, I see. If I heard right, you two have some sort of professional agreement? Uh, it's nothing bad. Oh, I wasn't worrying about that. Of course, if you have to explicitly deny it, then, uh... No. Just a joke. I'm sorry if I'm prying. You truly are interesting. Thanks for coming out today. We should head home. The controller's really bothering me. It's gonna get more and more irritating. I really need to sort it at some point. Really do. There's still no response from the Phantom Thieves to Medjad. What do you make of this? Most likely, the Phantom Thieves simply don't have the means of confronting them. After all, Medjad is quite different from anyone they've gone up against thus far. It seems their best option is to reveal their identities before more people are needlessly harmed. You really hit us where it hurts. We're going to beat them, though. Hmm. So I did more and more, so I just gotta keep an eye on a catchy and like, he's up to something, he's doing something, but... We need to go out and take on the Big Bang Burger Challenge, which we haven't done in a long while, have we? So Shibuya... Big Bang Burger. I'm a shapeshifter. Here we go. So we're going to Big Bang Burger. Come on, come on, come on. Take the challenge. Take it. We should do it this time. We should do it. Take your time. Thank you very much. Thank you for coming back to attempt the final mission again. This will be your foe. Now Bloody then. hell. Well then, it's time to get the 30 minute Big Bang Challenge started. Ready? Go! He never eats the fries though. Always pay attention to those fries. He never eats them. Looks like there's a whole head of lettuce in here. Burger's already cold. <sighs> Cold burger would not be fun. Don't think you have the luxury of enjoying the taste. Don't chew, just swallow. <sighs> I somehow ate the whole thing, but left the fries because the fries are not part of the challenge. Oh. Y you've done it again. Congratulations. My sincerest congratulations on completing the final challenge. Since you managed to top on the Cosmic Tower burger, I present to you the highest rank certification available here, the Captain Badge. Hey! 
And to the Burger Baron who defeated this challenge, we present to you our world famous Big Bang Burger on the house. We hope you enjoy the taste of victory. Wait. Please come again. You're hereby promoted to the rank of captain. No more challenges await you. But please do the challenge again and show us how gallant you are. All of us here at Big Bang Burger sincerely await your return. I knew you could do you it. You beat the Cosmic Tower. You were so admirable, taking on such a daunting task with the intense level of courage. <laughs> Lovely. Nice. Your pace, your strategy of using well-timed drinks, and just the spectacular way you devoured it. Everything was perfect. Lovely, lovely. Got to be close to finishing off some of these. Got to be. Want to head back? Come on. We should head home. I'm full just from watching you. Who could that be at this hour? I have a favor to ask. The student council has been getting complaints regarding a suspicious character in Ikibukuro. Yep. That's technically not the school's jurisdiction, but a lot of students do go there, so... I'm thinking of visiting tomorrow to investigate. Could I ask you to join me? What's the plan? You gonna go with Makoto? Um, respond later. Because there's a little thing I want to do before we head off there. Putting it off for now, huh? Don't forget to respond later. It's a new day, everyone. Some curry. I'm assuming it's the can we talk. I want to talk to you about something. You're the only one I can tell this to. About the track team. About me. Anyways, you're free? I'm eating now. Just, no. Please. Stop checking out your phone while you're eating. Just concentrate on your food. Too right, too right. Enjoy your meal. I don't think he liked that. Come on, let's finish eating and then send a reply once you go upstairs. Data. Alright, so what I need to go off and do is head over to um, Shinjuku and get another little reading. Bum, bum. So hot today, yes. Uh, get a fortune reading, please. What shall we do? Fortune. We want to get an affinity one, and we want that to be with Kawakami. This reading will cost you 5,000 yen, that's fine. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Your feelings should have reached the other person. Well, that's all for today. I hope it was helpful. What do you think? Hope you're happy with your fortune. I look forward to your next visit. Right, so what now I want to do is actually respond to Makoto. Receive complaints and bum bum bum. What's the plan? Are you going to go with Makoto? Head over immediately. Much appreciated. Several eyewitnesses reports have mentioned the planetarium. So that would be a good place to meet up, I think. I'll see you there. Someone suspicious at the planetarium. Wonder what's going on there. Well, no point ever thinking it. Let's head to the meeting spot. Ikibukuro. One of Tokyo's main hubs. Shops and entertainment surround the station. Enjoy the stars. The planetarium atop a skyscraper is the ultimate spot for viewing the stars. I I sort of like, what's the point in even putting that there? Because it's sort of a case of... 
it, you could just literally look at the stars on top of the building, right? Like that. That would be a good idea. Nope. All right. You now have information on a new hangout spot, Ikebukuro Planetarium. You can also invite people who may like it there to hang out with you. It seems. According to the letter, someone suspicious was seen around here. Let's take a look around before the lights go down. I'm just looking around here. It's like it's quite a large planetarium when you get down to it, isn't it? Like just, just I, you know, I think about it. I've never actually been to a planetarium. I don't think I have like at all. Hmm. This should be the place. That guy. Look, he's all alone. And he's scanning around the place. Definitely suspicious. Hmm. Wait, isn't that... Okay, let's go. Excuse me, uh, do you have a moment? Oh, Ren and the class president? Mishima-kun? What are you doing here? Wait, don't tell me the two of you are here on a, uh... Hmm. Here's that sort of thing of like, which one should I go with there? Like... Well, I... I um, should we tell him? Like, what we're doing? Like, is, like should it... should be? Hmm. It's a tough choice on that one. It's like, we're looking for someone. We'll, we'll go with that? I don't know. What's the best option there? That's the question. We'll go, we'll go with looking for someone. Wait, you mean... You're looking for leads on that suspicious guy? Yeah, it's just the thing. It's like a question of like whether he knew what was going on or anything like that. It's like... Hmm... <laughs> Do you know something, Mishima-kun? I just saw a post on the fan site that said there was someone suspicious at the planetarium in Ikibukuro. It was on the fan site? So you have a description to work from? Apparently he's the type that lives in his own world, totally disconnected from reality. Talking about the beauty of the universe, some kind of worldly balance, so a textbook crazy, textbook. Hmm. That sounds kind of familiar. You know someone like that? Jeez, you sure have all kinds of friends. Oh, yes we do. Oh, yes we do. Oh. I think that might be our guy. Look, he's talking to himself and seems super weird too. It's a question. Who's it gonna be? Is he coming this way? coincidence <laughs> it's, it's like out of everyone it's like it's it's gonna be him there's just no way around it is there it's just it's it's gonna be Yusuke ah what a coincidence yes you also seek answers to the mysteries of the universe let us pursue truth together oh crap Ren that's gotta be the weirdo and now he's trying to get us into his creepy cult how rude are you calling a weirdo uh, you. <laughs> well, you could at least phrase it more kindly, I think. I mean, I could have, yeah. So, this is a friend of yours. If you ask me, he needs to learn some manners. Sorry, Yusuke. I think this is all a big misunderstanding. Huh? You guys know him? I'm so sorry, I, I didn't know you guys were friends. You just matched the description of this weirdo I've been hearing about, so, uh... A weirdo, you say? The student council's been receiving letters, and there was posts on the site about some suspicious stranger. So, we came by to look around. All the rumors say some guy's been wandering around talking to himself. 
you know, rumbling out loud about stuff, like a total lunatic. Hmm. Strange indeed. I myself am occasionally compelled to muse aloud on the beauty and balance of the universe when it strikes me, but no doubt that's entirely unrelated. Uh, hmm. Wait, so that's gotta be... Wait, right, I should have known. Let's just put this behind us, shall we? All the dots question mark? At any rate, the screening is starting soon. Shall we take our seats? Yeah. And rest assured, I shall be keeping a vigilant eye out for this weirdo of yours. <laughs> that helps. <laughs> Don't mention it. Thanks for coming out with me today. Even though it was just Yusuke being Yusuke. But it's good that we were diligent. That's important for the Phantom Thieves, right? The stars were pretty... Exactly. Yes. It's important that we do all that we can. Shall we return home? Let's go home. Oh, at least we got the hangout spot. That's something. Man, it's hot. Never scorch you. Can't we catch a break? Alright, so, very much want to see what personas I've got here, because it's like we're going to be spending some time with Ketchy, which means we need a Justice, and we don't have a Justice. So, let's head over to the Velvet Room. Hey, inmate! Hey, inmate! Justice, justice, justice. Justine, you read here. Is there a simple, easy justice one? That's judge. We don't want judge. We want justice. Justice, justice, justice. There we are. Is a fee is required? This is your power. Me. Done already. What? Yes, 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 yes. Oh, I meant to. I meant to say, let's leave. No slacking off! I'm not slacking! That's why I came here for like this ex explicit purpose. Hmm? Someone's selling stuff there. Oh, they are. Right, so. Um, where is he? Oh, it's this one, isn't it? Yes, yes, he's around here. Let's head over. It's more, it's more near the darts and billiards, isn't he? That's where I should have gone. That's fine. I mean, I could have gone to the velvet room here. Can I not go up that road? Fine. I don't want to go up that road anyway. Didn't want to go there, mate. Didn't want to go there. Lovely little alleyway here. Again, all this kind of stuff just reminds me of Yakuza now. It's just instilled in my brain. Hi. Ren, good evening. Do you have some time right now? I do. There was a place I wanted to visit with you, but what do you think? It's a special place for me. I'm hoping you'll like it too. Archangel. What we got ourselves a gear. So what's the plan? Are you going to spend some time? Let's do it. Great. Actually, really close. Just follow me. I'll take you there. An empty glass. Jazz. Hey. This is it. It's a rather nice place. It's not quite an apology for that little incident back at the cafe, but rest assured, we're safe here. I'm a regular. It's nice to take some time off when we can, don't you think? What kind of place is this? It's just a jazz club. You get to hear some great performers here. Hmm. Oh, I'm not gonna say, do they have coffee? Even if that was in the guide, I'd be like, no, screw it. I'll sacrifice the points. Now this is my kind of club. Do like a bit of jazz, it's nice. I'm glad you're so taken with it. Is it safe to assume you've visited places like this before? Very well. In any case, uh, let us go. Let's head in. Jazz club. Take your time. What will you do? Well then, why don't we get some drinks? Hmm. Any recommendations? Nothing in particular. But if you don't mind me choosing, then I'll put in a random order. You don't have any soft drinks you actively dislike, yes? Oh. 
I like this guy's setup. Thanks for waiting, here's your order. We have a special performance today, so I hope you enjoy it. Looks like it's starting. Let's sit back and enjoy the show. I enjoyed listening to music with Akechi. Hmm, how relaxing. I really do like coming here. It's a great place. I'm glad to hear you say that. Work and obligations take me to quite a few restaurants and cafes. But this place is a little more special to me. Guess you could call it my go-to place. Do you have anywhere like that? Uh, uh, I'm not saying that. It's like, um, a rundown cafe. <laughs> Hmm. Cafe, hmm? Sounds like you have good taste. Really? So you came to Tokyo on your own. And now you live in a cafe lot. Impressive. It's like something out of a story. Yeah, or a game. Though I have to say, I am envious. You must be quite well stocked on coffee. And curry! I live alone myself, but I rarely have the time to cook my own meals. That reminds me. Do you cook? Well, I can use a microwave. <laughs> that makes two of us. Frozen meals and convenience store food are tasty enough, don't you think? They're all right. Usually come here when I need some time to really think on my own. So chatting with you here is really quite refreshing. Speaking of which... You know, you're the first person I've ever brought here. It's not like I was keeping it from anyone, but... As it goes to show, we do have some strange connection. I feel like my bond with Akechi is growing deeper. Sleeping Mastery. Chance to reveal all of one enemy's affinities at the start of battle. Ooh. Ooh, 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 yes. All right. Please let me have that, yes. Give it. Ah, it's gotten late. We should probably be going. Goodbye. Well, see you later. Fare thee well! Hey, it's me. Uh, are you good to talk right now? Wasn't the music today wonderful? Live bands always have this certain power to their music. Certainly the point of jazz, since all those jam sessions. A sea of improvisation, both complex and organic. As each player incorporates their own flavors, a natural melody is born from chaos. There's something about that strange erratic synchronicity. It's a euthoria like when I managed to solve a case. Uh, what are you talking about? No, I kind of get it. Kind of. Well, I'm glad I brought you along then. Thought I'd have more luck if I brought someone who I know can keep up with me intellectually. Jazz is a deep and complex style. I'd love for us to sit down and really talk about it sometime. I should let you go. Somehow I always end up talking more than usual when it's with you. I expect another invitation soon. For now, please excuse me. I will excuse you, yes. You are excused. Be gone. 31st. A Sunday. It's quite bright. Hey! Shouldn't you tell the others about the target in mementos? No. I'll do it on my own time. Right, so, let's go visit Best Girl again. It's so hot up. today. Place my shop on the street so I can see people walking by, but I'm about to melt. At least you're in the shade at the moment. Well then, shall I read your fortune in detail? Get a fortune reading. Oh, please take a seat. Right, so we want to get affinity what for Arn here. Um, we want an affinity reading first. Right, so we want Arn. 5,000 yen, of course, of course. Here we go. Ba, ba, ba. <laughs> your feeling should have reached the other person. I bet you can deepen your friendship even further now. Good. Well, that's all for today. I hope it was helpful. What do you think? Hope you're happy with your fortune. I look forward to your next visit. And speaking next visit, um, straight back in with another one. 
want to get our guts up. What shall we do? Which fortune would you like to have read? Um, this time we want a luck reading. Have fortune read. There goes all our money. Jeez. Alright, please think of some area in which you like to increase your look. So, we want guts. <laughs> the Fool card. Seems you'll greatly benefit from taking actions that will increase your guts. Alright. That's all for today's improvement reading. Because it's a Sunday. We need to go get a nasty Al Algeria. That's not what I want. How did I get on that? What was it? What? Assist. I didn't know that was a thing! I could have just gone there! Wait, like, what? Oh my! That's gonna make things much quicker! That was an accidental press. That's what I was trying to get, like, to the map. And I pressed that by accident just based on other games I'm playing. Like, oh! Why did no one tell me that existed? <laughs> anyway. Like, that's gonna save me so much time. So happy I found that. So happy I found that. Right, anyway. Algeria. Uh, Algeria. How do you say this? What do you want? Nasty Algeru. Al, Al is, it, is it. Is it Algeria? I don't know. I really don't know. Right, we got that sorted. We got that sorted. Well then. Oh, well then. Alright, chug it down. Nice chugging. Ugh. <laughs> Nice. Uh, good job, I was watching you try so hard. Yay! Take off the guts! Oh dear. Okay, now you're healthy, let's go somewhere else. Let's use this and actually go to Arn, because that's obviously who we're going to be spending time with based on what we did with Chihaya, so... We'll just Guess now wait we wait. Now. The suspense is seriously killing me. I really want to eat something sweet right now. You're in the same boat as me, right? Right? Um, we're in the mall right now? We're not on a boat? What? I feel like my bond with Arn will grow stronger soon. Uh, I need to get lovers, don't I? So decline. Oh, that's too bad. Let's see about the velvet room. Is there any problem like going into a um, hey, palace and mean? then coming out? It's like we need to get all this sorted again. Ow! I can get rid of Phoenix though now. I don't need that. How goes? So actually, let's let's do Time that right now. Um, itemize persona. Some modification, huh? we've done faith. And we're I done on that. Behold, it's new for this may prove somewhat extreme. Oh my! Again, that's gotta be quite painful, I imagine. I would never like to experience it to find out. I do, you know, I'm against that. If someone said, do you want to sit in this chair and get electrocuted to see how it feels? Yeah, I'd be no. No would Finished be what I say now. there. No. You'd like to read the compendium. All right, so what did we need? We needed lovers, didn't we? Lovers, lovers, lovers. Where are you? There it is. Um, simple pixie would do that, wouldn't it? Is then accept this persona. Seems we're only finished? getting it for the what? social no link, social link, off. confidant, whatever you want to call it. So, um, let's use use the thingy again. Like, confidants, boom. Ah, oh, I'm I'm glad I found that by accident. So nice. We'll just yes, now we wait. The suspense is seriously killing me. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, yeah. Same boat. We're not in a boat. That was the joke. Hang out with her. Um, Alright, in that case, let's go get crepes. <gasps> with tons of extra toppings. Oh, I agree. I love a crepe. I do love crepes. <sighs> Looks like they're not doing their famous double chocolate crepes today. They have the worst luck. Oh, an email. Hmm? Looks like it's from the agency. I wonder what they could want. Mika? At Skytree? Where's that? Um. Ren's just like, what are you on it? You're just saying words right now. They want me to head over for a shoot now. It feels pretty familiar, doesn't it? 
Basically, this men's magazine is running a Mika special to try and capitalize on her recent popularity. But apparently, she asked for me specifically to star alongside her for the shoot. I wonder why. Ah, uh, she admires you. I'm sure. Uh, so you think what she said earlier was the truth? Hold on, though. How would you trick someone you admire? Well, I guess I won't know what she wants unless I head over. Hey. Have you been to Skytree before? How do you get there? What? Let's go. Oh, uh, uh, can, can you come with me? Actually, I've already decided for you. You're going. Come on. Like, well, I've got other things to do. I've got, I've got my whole day planned. Uh -uh. Fine. A popular old town area known for the Sensoji Temple and the Tokyo Sky Tree. Tourist heaven. Nakamisidori. How close was I on that? It's a hit with tourists. Colorful shops of all kinds line the streets. All right. Asakusa. I'm sure I'm right on the Asakusa. There's certain things where it's like it feels like I'm right. Probably because I've heard them before or something like that. <sighs> All right. We made it. Wait. Where's Mika? Oh. So you came for my special. You asked for me, right? Wow, I barely recognize you. Mm -hmm. Did you lose weight? Or maybe change your makeup? The theme for today's shoot is the elegance of woman. So I conditioned my body to be more elegant. What? What do you mean? Controlling what you eat, how you move, uh, that's all. It may sound easy, but it's pretty tough. You have to write down everything you eat, making sure to check the nutritional and caloric content. I even hired a personal trainer to take special note of my diet and oversee my exercise regimen. Wow. Oh, that's amazing. Does that mean you don't get to eat double chocolate crepes? Yeah, I don't think that'd be worth it. I mean, double chocolate crepes. Come on. Come on. All the dots. Of course I don't. I get fat with just one bite of that stuff. Not to mention the other stuff I do. I take herbal medication, wear warming socks, do pilates, and yoga. Day after day. How many squats do you think I do in a week? Seven. Seven. Mm, a natural beauty like you could never understand how much work I put into my modeling. <laughs> you know, it's kind of embarrassing getting complimented like that. Sorry, did I say natural beauty? What I meant was a natural airhead. What did you say? Who are you calling an airhead? Han Senpai, stop it. You're scaring me. Mika-chan, are you okay? Man, cat fights are scary. This way, Mika-chan. Yeah, that's perfect. That's exactly the expression I'm looking for. Giggle. Wonderful, wonderful. I see now. This is a test. Well, I'm not gonna lose. <laughs> um, Anchan, uh, could you try being a little sexier? You mean like this? Oh, that's beautiful. Wait! M Mika, why are you doing this? I, I thought you looked up to me. You should have known that was a lie. But I guess you're just as naive as you look. I really like it when they actually do the double dots on the naive. Like that, that is how it's spelled, so. Anyway, stupid amateurs like you really piss me off. You better not drag me down, okay? Oh, you're amazing, Mika chan. Oh, you know that president of the fancy car company? Introduce me, please. <laughs> the only even invited me to dinner. You know, working with all of you just makes me so happy. All the dots. Um... I'm heading home. We've arrived back in Shibuya. All the dots. There's a problem child over there. <laughs> Cause, uh, uh, why did Mika ask for me? Hmm. It's very much because, uh, so she could show you up. It's really why. I see. She was just trying to be mean. All the dots. 
If that's the case, I probably deserved everything she did. Oh, the dots. Uh, 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 ch 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 cheer up. All oh, the dots. I'm... I'm so pissed off! Mika had to work super hard every day to get where she is now. She worked out, watched her diet, made friends with everyone. She could rely on connections like I did. She didn't become a model just for the heck of it. Her resolve, her knowledge, her fashion sense. They're all on a totally different level from me. Mika is amazing. Mika is... Mika is strong. But me, I'm nothing. Just thinking about that makes me so angry. I, I feel like I could explode. This whole time, I've just been pretending to model. It's like the clothes were wearing me. I mean, that's what I always thought being a model meant. But I was totally wrong. A real model draws out the beauty of the clothes they wear, casts a stunning magic on them. A real model is flexible, beautiful, and strong. Now I've had enough pretending. I want to be a real model. Like, go get them, Tiger. Right. I'll give it my all. I'm gonna take the world by storm. Just you watch, Ren. I sense a heightened motivation from Arn. Yeah, lovers are gone up. Nothing special over the right. next piece. Uh, it's so mad. It's the perfect time for sweets, but no, I won't eat them. I mean, I will, but not today. You eat some for me, Ren. I gotta do what now? Bye. Later. What? That's not on. Ren, it's me. I've been pissed since I left. I can't help it. Well, I'll say it again. I'm taking the muddling world by storm, and I don't care what I have to do to get there. Obviously, that means dieting, cutting back on food, and no matter how tough it is, I'll do any workout. But, well, you got this. Yep, I'm so sick of feeling how I did today. This is a first. For me, actually. Feeling this pissed off, I mean. Usually, even if I have a crappy day, I just get over it by having snacks, watching TV, and sleeping it off. But this time, it's different. I want to change. Tomorrow, I want to be better than I am today. Gotta start my stretching session. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Evening. So, what's going on? Haven't heard of any developments. Medjet hasn't taken any action either. Heard some company's private data got leaked or something. Did Medjet do that? Are the Phantom Thieves sitting on their hands? Do something! Oh dear. Man, it's hot. Another scorcher, can't we catch a break? I heard some company's info got leaked. Yes, it seems the private dealings of a large corporation were publicly disclosed. It's caused quite the stir. But I'm wondering if Medjet is behind it. Hmm. That wasn't their promise. Indeed. I doubt they'd do anything before the deadline they imposed on us. This seems to be just a minor thing. Quite different from what Medjet has done up until now. Is that so? So it wasn't Medjet? Damn, that shit freaked me out. It's honestly kind of hard not having a knee-jerk reaction to this stuff nowadays. Sometimes people react to these situations by pleading for help from the Phantom Thieves. We need to find a way to stand up for them. Indeed we do. But for now, we're done with this part. We'll see you in the next part. It's on for now.